We also look ahead towards there for this Cleveland squad. You got Floriel Naylor behind the plate. That's a gold glove defense. Andrew Heaney to Miles Straw. And the first Jankowski, and there's one away. One pitch. One. Good clubhouse, a good group of guys. Uh, and that, that's part of it. You don't want to. On the ground right. One of the goals team. Now, two quick outs for Heaney, and here's Bo Naylor from Canada. And that one, a loud fly. Boom, there's Langford, and an easy uh, Jonah Heim. One of the new faces who could be a part of the mix. Jared Walsh, a chance to earn the. There's Shane Bieber on the hill for the Guardians and the former Cy. That one fouled back, one and six. Two and one to Marcus. Such a big pitch for Bieber over the years. Now he's built half. In the air, right side, but in Major League history. He works his way to the plate a lot. And here he works a walk, so the leadoff man on board. Work on the backfield so far this spring, sporting a 1080 ERA and just under two. Here's Jankowski. He was a free agent at the end of the year, but brought back. And he filled in so nicely in the first half of the spin for Adolis Garcia. Well, in game four. Yeah, obviously you're not going to see the. They get the out at second. Yeah, we're going to get another look at it. It's a nice turn here, obviously going. Wasn't even really close. Okay. Well, here's Wyatt Langford. He's having it going. That one popped up. And he puts it away. And uh, just love the fact that. Uh, you know, it's it's about as exciting for first. It uh, doesn't seem like Been it was that Dolly long ago. Oh, Bill and game that four. is something that <laughs> in the Valley of the Sun, can't yeah, you? You can. <laughs> That's the first base runner for the W all off season long. Like fans were so high of reliving it all over again. That was Simeon for the second out. Off home run that was played in the open. You know that that's going to be played forever. Um, obviously, the the Adolis. Uh, the, uh, the outfield assist. Cal Manzardo takes a strike from here. Uh -huh. Season and everyone went crazy in the dugout when he did it. There's a nice slider from him. And Andrew Haney was himself with the fan base. Trying to get Manzardo there. He gets him. Threw the fastball right by him. Than anywhere else. El Bombi back in there for going to get a louder or more thunderous applause than Adolis. You know, he's got the flair. He loves to, he, he doesn't mind being the center of a team. It was such a great mix. Clubhouse can help elevate a team. And Adolis goes down. Wality, the character that he is, well, all that stuff fits into this. Quite realize. And Jonah Heim. There's a good team. They're a talented team. I'm not saying that they're not going to get to the playoffs. Is that the Rangers clubhouse last year was just exactly what they needed to, to win a championship? Neurological issues, but he's healthy, and he's had a great camp so far. Yeah, he has. He's struggled a little. Right side on the ground, and that's through for a base hit. And he's getting plenty of opportunity to give Bruce Bochin. And I asked him. Those are, and he screwed up, and he pounced. Which one fits your size, right? Now everybody gets everything <laughs> custom, and you can figure out, you know, what number you use. right. You know it. Swing. uniforms. They were revealed just in the last week. I've got Jonah Himes old and then you got the cap too. These are going to be hot selling items. Rangers tea in gold and this is a tradition uh, Jared and he's uh, gold collection World Series uh, uniforms. That gold trim it's another reminder. Yeah. Neat when you wear like a boat. I'm sure there's got to be Oh, he got out of the box really well. You know, that was an interesting part of what Andrew used that as a tool last year. That's big, right? You know, even though that's really not something that he's accustomed to doing, 
you know that you're shooting your infielders, there's a good chance that you're going to turn two. And last year's Rangers infield, second time up for Straw, flied out his first. He knows the pitch clock running down. Have been informed to start getting the clock going earlier. Your games last year, so uh, we'll see how it does. Along with his sharper version in the lower 80s. And you'll get pitcher great opportunity to try and figure stuff out. Yeah, that's the best part of being in. You've really got to pound the strike zone. Or, you know, you think about guys kind of reinventing themselves over the years. And it was only two or three miles an hour off his fastball. It was, it was a tricky pitch. There's on it. Yeah, you talked about that slider. I didn't get a look at the, the velo on that one, but it doesn't. Season. Stranding runners. And he's one out away from doing that in the plate, both from Mississauga, Ontario. With me, how many of you play lacrosse? Is that and Simeon? Chris.com <laughs> slash season tickets. Leone Tavares leading off the bottom of the 30. And that one's ripped towards the middle and a base hit. You know, during the regular season, you obviously hit her in Marcus, Marcus Simeon that I'm talking about, drove in 100 runs out of the... When we learned that Julio Rodriguez had been added to the team. A great first half and stepped up when Corey Seager was out and guys were... That one's cracked on the... On the turn, double play. Second caliber all-star type form. He just wasn't that guy last... As Tanner Bybee looked great last year. What's he going to, you know, to do to, to follow up what he did, what they do offensively? And really good teams can be that struggled because along the way, but then came to into form ball. at the right time in October. And to go to, you, know, you think about the additions of guys like David Robertson's S at the major league level uh, and so many of the, the returners from last year. He got noticed even before, and we will. Out on the backfields as we got an update on the injured players. That would be, of course, Corey Seager. Left calf. He's coming along. Uh, Corey Seager as well had the uh, sport along, and uh, Jared Sandler and David Murphy, uh, as Bruce Bochy said, the opening night is one of 162. Any of those 162 is possible. Here, and as good as Corey Seager was, you know, of, of a season as he was having a few months in. The lotter into center. Excuse but the nope. production was high level. Speaking of, few get at bats for Z. in surprise. That one smoked up. He drops one in there. He's digging for. These big old gaps. That's the difference. The ball carries out here in Arizona. So this is Manzardo. He needs an opposing team going with six lefties in their lineup. Uh, I'm trying to show off your own risk. Slider in the counts one and two. He got Manzardo with the elevated fast slider and every once in a while a changeup. Like what what do they see? <laughs> what are we missing? Yeah, they're so good at developing pro past the numbers, right? They don't get it right off. Swing and a miss. Heaney goes back to the slider. Top man of their rotation. Uh, we're happy to be back on the Red Sox at the end. Those are going to be back in Arlington. The exhibitions do up for the Rangers in the fourth. Trying to get to Shane Bieber. Hit into one of them, though. I think we're pretty confident that if there were a replay, that would not. Well, one of the things, but you know, more often than not, he's a really patient hitter. Serves one to left. Don't. I didn't get him. Yeah. And kind of. Here's Wyatt Langford. I want a hot shot in the Tokyo. Gets up and throws. He's not maybe Adolis Garcia, but he's a physical specimen. Uh, you know that he's got tools, but the speed for the size, it's just is truly read about him throughout his career at Florida. You know, didn't even play much as a freshman and thrown into the three hole for the World Series champions. And you're, and you're performing. Having a blast here in Surprise. Good spring work for him. Mix in some strikeouts. He has, you know, locked in. Someone's always watching. 
But it was a walk rate that was uncharacteristic for and that could that could be a, a bunch of different things and I remember seeing him kind of frustrated walk the biggest deal in the world it's it's always good to have feel comfortable going into the regular season well, Simi, DFW sports fans he's a huge Thunder fan if those two teams meet in the post ball that just kind of found some real estate start there's a hot shot that turns Sim at one point Late on the fastball, Heaney pumps it by. Safety to make sure that your body's in place, that head's not moving, and you can catch that fastball out front. So if you're in the air to right, sinking comes up, misses the cutoff man, but good heads up baseball by Davis Wenzel for 80. But just so much has been talked about on just the way he receives the ball, his frame. You have to give him a lot of credit for the success that the pitching had last year. And Iron Man behind the plate, as you'll see it. He hit the lotter. And Himes retired. Walsh just fouled. I mean, felt like reuniting with Tim would help him. And then Walsh lays off. Talk about some future power. It's decent. Well, Barlow gets him with the breaking ball. Walsh was a two way player. Position is a huge one. You don't usually hear a bunch of hubbub about a break it down. Like hitting coaches earn clicking on all cylinders. So it's your job as a hitting coach to be breaking down. Vid Barlow gets back in it after falling behind. Three, two, and he got him. So Barlow hit a two five. ERA and probably enjoyed. And he remembered he went through the whole lineup and has never had success against him. Well, Naylor stays alive down one and two. I don't know. It's, uh, we got to expound on that. Fourth Cactus League appearance of the spring and he gets Naylor. Pitches in because you're, you're trying to hit a, a number of pitches as you continue to build up. Steve pitches in his outing today. Trying to build that count up. You got to go do some more work. Fry with the green lights and unfair assistance. And Duffy walked. And he pitched a part of some. Oh, DeLauder hammers one to right. Jankowski going back on it. Hong gets that foot down. Kind of an unorthodox swing, almost Drokio. And that one fouled off his foot. But the way that he went about his business and well, the word that a lot of his teammates used was donated. Yeah, if you, if you truly love the game, you're not doing it because you love the game. You've played it at the highest level. Broken bat, zooms it up. Two outs. You're only given a short window of time to do it in your life. You know, if it way, if you don't have a nagging injury, why not go for it? Well, he half hour baseball game, uh, but I enjoyed it every second of it. Go out there and step on the field. Now, Tim Heron, the new pitcher, and all the other members of the support staff who they take on all fortunate well and think about it too from their perspective because a 10 12 maybe 15 years um, and you're going to be done by about the time that you're hard to keep these guys healthy forever to go into and talk about some just some well-spoken words on all sides and it's got that i that i can share and both of those were really good <laughs> No singing, though. I Three and one to one. Some beverages. That was quick by you. Swing and a miss. Aaron was going if we're going to win this World Series. And for so long, it didn't happen. The defense was steady. He made. Swings against the Diamondbacks that left the yard. Leave the yard. But I don't think we had any road bumps this time around. And with the Braves. 
And he throws a splitter right there. It's Bottom drops out. Weak contact there. Caber Rodriguez, the new. And Andrew Knapp now behind the plates. Probably go to Andrew Kisner. Well, you can never have. Get some, some good depth. You know the guys that are great defensive sort. Swing and a miss. Tana late on the fastball. Yates almost got the chase there. Looking to see how Bruce Bochy deploys him. That one's lobbed to center. Thing for the first time. Well, one of the things that's interesting about Kirby is so tough against lefties, it's not conventional to. Absolutely. Uh, that, that's splitter plays either way. And it is in, so uh, that is nasty. There it goes, the skate. Yeah, you've got to be super talented. You've got to have things go your way. You have to stand. Is, you remember that horrific labor. Altuve hit three homers in his first three at bats. Uh, you know, the, the Rangers pitching had ever given up in a three game series or something crazy. When Carter is not called up, you know, and, and not to mention. Moments impact a team. And it's not like Evan Carter came up and the team just hit some games off. And who knows? Maybe that Langford can run and he beats it out. But there's a lot of guys that you don't know what's going to happen. So here's Adolis. Is when he'd be back. And he came back and he came back. There's no better guy. Slam in the Crawford boxes. Ivory and being a fan. Nap fouls on away. It's a pretty crowded catcher's room with. Scoreless. That one gets away. Rangers of the runner in scoring position. Hmm. Yeah, you see Langford cruising to 97 mile an hour fastball. Isn't an easy pitch to block. You know that? that one fouled back. So now heading my way, you're going to dive in front of me. <laughs> Swing and a miss. Smith goes to the Guardians leading. Of your inning that you are in regular season form. Would you pronounce yourself? You're at this point of spring training where you're 16 days. I like where I'm at. Um, still work to be done. We still got a lot of time. You can simply keep that going the rest of the year. All right, tell me about joining this team. You're a veteran guy. You guys, you know, obviously they're very talented on the baseball field. They won World Series. Maddox. Yeah, Mike's good. Uh, you know, we're starting to get used to each other. Magic shows going on here? Oh, yeah. You know, at this point, you kind of. So the bullpen is definitely entertaining. Um, it's a great spot to be during baseball game. Not pitching and doesn't bother the guy that's got to go get ready. All right, you are with a great organization with the Braves. Uh, and, um, and look, they both win. They, they want to win, and they're both driven to win. All right. A great assessment there at the beginning of how he feels. Everybody talks about the stuff. It sounds like it. First outing on February 23rd. Well, he was spring. Downs that fastball up to the mid to throw 90. And Mark said, I can do it. Now a pitcher. And he loses. Neuron. He's faced 23, so it's almost like he's faced the minimum over seven innings. Yates has been closing out games or getting you big outs in the eighth inning. You know, by today's standards, that's usually not going to blow it by you. He can dial it up a little bit more than that. Hot shot. It's good, quick hands here by Planas. Pretty impressive. He club, but not tough to get admission into this club. Club of guys in that Rangers club. I almost brought it up a few innings ago when you were talking about Danny Duffy and his influence and just. Tolentino. And Tolentino stays alive. Church. Gets him with the slider. Searching for number one today and former Rangers. 
It speaks to the athleticism. We kind of talked about that a little. Definitely a small sample. Um, I'll take White got it going with the bat. There's a power slider, swing and a miss. He gets her a booming double to the wall. Devers. Guardians did not acquire Rafael Devers. That's his cousin, Jose. Comes from the 21-year-old. It's a nice swing for the third rounder back in 2000. Back in 2021. Let's see if the Rangers can cash in. They're cooking now in the bottom. All up with the knock and a swing and a miss, and Ghost gets him on three pitches. So over your head? Yeah. Okay. We'll work on it. Yep. We got time. Spring training. Cal made the club out of the bullpen, and he's one of these vet. Nice pitch there, and he gets ahead one and two. Well, from the next man up. And there's always the the sentiment too that. If you're, they usually will give you the option. Uh, they'll, they'll get you out of there if some other big league. Base hits. Is Hideki Kuri, Kuriyama, who is the manager for Team Jupiters and throughout much of this game, uh, Bochi game, uh, Bochi was talking about. It's talent and more coming from Japan to America. Yep. Coming more commonplace, not only for these guys to come over, but. It was, was pretty incredible and then obviously uh, got to see it with you, Darvish, here. Kaz Sasaki. Well, like he missed with location a little bit. Uh, this is a, a perfectly dotted changeup. And he pops one up. Rodriguez gives way. Collie. Surprise. Or go to a National League foe. And uh, One team in your division, or obviously four teams in your division, almost 20 times in a season, seeing some, some different faces. Frenier Chavez fouls one back again. Field because when he was with the Nationals, he was hurt. A fan base not having the opportunity to see him. 100%. Here you could maybe see it in person every year, at least on TV. Be hard on baseball. Strike three outside. Could you join us on Bally Sports? It's Thursday night. First pitch this pass. There's Derek Hill. There's a loud. And Hill. By Hill. Nice looking double. Stays back on it. Drives that ball to the opposite way. Regular season. They're starting to see the ball well. To be ready once April starts. This is of other teams. Same with Mike Trout. But you know, from a competitive standpoint. Uh, you love being able to see it. But then, you know, when you're a fan of a team and he's hurting your team, kind of one of those things. And there are two outs. Tons of performances, but the Angels haven't been winning. Two-run home run. And the count's one and two. He misses with the foul. There's a ground right to Delgado. Over.